And good morning, good afternoon, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is a podcast I know we're from Orlando, Florida, on this awesome and international podcast, Good Wine and Great Laughs, Season 5, Episode 20, ladies and gentlemen. And today is the season finale of this season number 5. And today is Saturday, December 24th, Christmas Eve. And the weather here in Portland it will be mostly sunny, it was sunny early. <laughs> uh, and high winds gusts possible, highs of 49, lowers of 32 degrees, ladies and gentlemen. So it's already cold since last night. The temperature is dropping all over the country. In the United States now, the temperature is dropping like it's hot. But before I jump right on the topic, we got to talk about the wine of the day. And because it's Christmas Eve, we are about to celebrate popping bottles right here at Casa Casa Novo in second because it's also a reason of celebration because today, besides being the season finale, also I'm celebrating 100 episodes of this awesome international podcast, Good Wine and Great Life Places, about to pop this joint here. Woo-hoo-hoo! Let's go! This is the wine of the day, ladies and gents. It's a nice Espumante wine. It's called Paquette Cadu. It's French and meaning translated to English, Paquette Cadu means a gift package. So it's a wide, great wine, white wine, ladies and gents. Excellent wine. I give all the information about this wine and how I rate on today's episode. And today's episode, I'm talking about celebrating black excellence, ladies and gents. They'll talk about the lives of Jess L. Brown, the Navy, the first black Navy aviator. As well, I'm talking about Joseph. Joseph Boulogne, a.k.a. the Chevalier of St. George, ladies and gents. As far as Jess L. Brown, there is a move that I already discussed that before I talked about before. The little bit example is called Devotion. It's Christmas season right now, ladies and gents. This is an awesome movie for you guys to see it. Take your whole entire family with you, especially if you have young boys. This is an awesome movie that's going to show the perseverance of another black man that strives to achieve greatness. That's why I'm celebrating black excellence because I'm also use the example of talking about them and also their movies now about their lives. So the first one right now, the Jesse L. Brown is his version. And the second one, and I made an apology on my podcast because I thought the movie's name was Cavalier, but it's not Cavalier, the right pronunciation because the French word is called Chevalier. The Chevalier of St. George is about the life of Joseph Boulogne, and he was a son of a... I wouldn't say plantation, but this man has slaves, properties in Guadeloupe. And after son, uh, Joseph was like a uh, tender age, I believe between about seven years old, seven to ten years old, the parents took him to um, France. The father took him to France to have brought his mother. You know, his mother was a, a second lead slave. So, that was the podcast all about. Um, we're talking about Jesse Brown. I have a nice document, not documentary, but it's for, for I believe it is a gentleman called. Give me a second, real quick, ladies and gents. Let me go right there. Yes, I found this. Uh, it's called the by the history guy. And from this YouTube channel called the History Guy, talking about the Jesse Brown and Thomas Hudner. A tale of two pilots, ladies and gentlemen. So, and then on the next one, that's going to be on block two, you're going to hear about the untold story of Joseph Boulogne, the prodigy known as the Black Mozart. 
So that's what this podcast is all about, ladies and gents. I'm closing the year celebrating black excellence because there are so many things that could be achieved of other black people that end up being caught on the slave trade or also besides the slave trade all the shenanigans that black people all over the world had to endure as far as slavery as far as discrimination and how many things could be achieved if it did not happen ladies and how many dreams has been lost how many achievements in science politics uh mathematics and so many things that could be achieved by black people that do not have the chance and the opportunity to study to be on the best that they could be because of racism so this is a great 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 podcast i'm closing the year with an awesome one talk about us talk about those that achieved they went to the top of it and I can't wait. I believe the movie Chevalier is coming next year. I believe it's in March. But do not quote on that. I know it's coming next year. If I'm not mistaken, it's coming March. If it's not, keep your eyes and ears open about this movie Chevalier. You can also Stop the name Chevalier, and you're going to see the because I already have the trailer on YouTube. So I believe it's going to be an awesome movie, and also then I'll tell the story about him on my podcast. You're going to learn a lot because I didn't even know he existed. So that's another thing too. Sometimes greatness had happened was achieved by uh, one of our brothers or sisters, but because the prejudice and everything has been hidden to not show how great they were you know by the oppressors so once again ladies and gentlemen this is about casanova i wish you guys a merry christmas i wish you guys a blessed christmas with your families and friends and also ladies and gentlemen i pray to god and i wish you guys a awesome wonderful full of blast blessings for 2023 you know that we can accomplish everything that we put your mind to it and then we need to work for it because i'm doing this because i have a goal but i'm not going to tell you what my goal as far where i want to be in this podcast but i need your help ladies and to achieve some goals and if you like my work that i do in this podcast please do not forget to subscribe i'm getting closer to now i'm closing today's season five with almost 9,000 views since September, let's say. Uh, people are listening and watching my videos. I appreciate that, but what I mean, I mean missing as you guys should give a click on the like button as well, click on the subscription button. If you like the work that I do, please help me to increase those numbers. I appreciate that very much, ladies and gentlemen. So once again, this is by Casanova from Portland, Florida. It's cold here. The temperature is born, it's dropping like it's hot. My fireplace is already burning because <laughs> I'm not gonna be feeling cold in my own at Casa Casanova, ladies and gents. So temperature is dropping and be safe out there. Protect yourself, your family. Once again, be safe, be kind, and be blessed. And I'm coming back on the first Saturday of the January. 2023. So once again, salute. Enjoy your holidays. Later.